Hello and welcome back to my channel. Today we are going to be filming a Ipsy on bagging. Um, I actually really thought this was my monthly subscription, but I forgot. Um, I ordered the mystery bag for this month. It's the holiday mystery bag and I figured I'd go ahead and film it and see if you guys thought it was worth it because right now you do still have some time to order um ipsy stuff before the holidays in case you want to get somebody something from ipsy um, i think this bag was around 14 dollars, and it actually comes in this gold bag so ipsy real is really just a monthly beauty subscription they started out with a regular monthly subscription when i started the bags were only ten dollars a month and you got five deluxe size samples in them sometimes being a lipstick or an eyeliner or something like that you did get a full size uh but now they have like changed everything they've like i guess had a makeover uh, they have the regular ipsy glam bag which is now twelve dollars a month only way to lock in the ten dollars is to do the yearly uh pay for it all for the whole year or they have the Ipsy Plus, which will run you $25, but it has five full-size products, and everything you get from Ipsy is um, higher-end products. Now, here lately, in the last, like, let's say four months, I have received some drugstore makeup, which, Pixie, I'm pretty much all right with that, um, but getting um, Wet n' Wild, no, I'm not okay with that. Um, I don't that's a very cheap brand at the drugstore. I mean, what's their highest product? $5. Uh, so, I'm just not really okay with that. And, um, which I received a highlighter. And I think the highlighters are like $3.99 or something like that. Around $4. Okay, but now then they have the Ipsy Ultimate. Which is 12 products. 8 being full size. And 4 being deluxe size samples. Um. And you get a bag in each one. Each bag in every, like me, I get all three bags. Um, so I get three different makeup bags every month. Um, but they'll be in the same, like, color range. So they'll all three match. They'll just be different shapes and sizes. Okay. So this is, like I said, the holiday mystery bag. And um, you're supposed to get, I think, five mystery products in here in the mystery bag. Um, I did think it was my... Um, at first when I seen it, uh, coming in the mail today, because my Ipsy Plus was sent out like a week and a half, almost two weeks ago, and I still haven't received it. I think it was like two weeks ago it was sent out, and I know the mail's a little behind because it is the holidays, and I do get that. But, now, I only ordered this like four, three or four days ago, and I've already received it. It came like, I think, towards like... I kind of want to say FedEx, maybe DHL. I'm not, I don't really remember. But I got it like three or four days, ordered it three or four days ago. And I'm already got it. But I love a good mystery. So I figured we'd do this. Okay. So I like the bag. I've got something similar to this, if not the similar bag. Because, you know, I get MC every month. But I was thinking it was a different color. I'm not really for sure. Because I know we got one with this texture. Um, and you got the little thing that says Ipsy, but I do like the bag, very cute, and the zipper is gold. Okay, so with this, I guess you don't get no cards or anything like that, uh, since it's not theme. It, well, it is theme. It is a holiday theme mystery bag. Okay, so our first item is Moods by Laura and Jazz. Um, I actually did get the big palette in my, um, Ipsy bag. I'm not really for sure if this color, it, why well, I ain't opened it yet, so I don't know. Uh, hopefully it's a different color than I got, because I was like, I know blue, there's a yellow, there's a green and blue, so I'm not for sure. So this is a brown. It's just a brown. Now, I can't remember if there was a brown in it or not. So, you know, you can use a brown for about anything. You need a good, it ain't like too neutral, but you could actually like put it on lightly and use it as a blending shade. I don't know. So, that's kind of cute. 
Okay, so our next thing is by Dome Beauty. Okay, so it is Chick Envy English Rose. It is 2.5 grams and it is 0 0.088 ounces. So here's the box. Now, actually, I don't think I've ever received anything from Dome Beauty, so this is like something new for me. Because I do have that palette, and I'm not really for sure. If the color came in it, I'll just have a double, or I can just throw it in, like, um, my single eyeshadows. So, that's a cute little blush, and it is called English Rose. And it's very, like, silky and soft. So... There it is. That's a pretty color. You could use that for an eyeshadow, too. It's really soft. It kind of feels like jelly, but it's not. I don't think it is. It's just a very, it's a pressed powder blush. Okay. And it is vegan. Cruelty free. I don't know if you guys can see that. Okay, so two out of two so far. We're doing good. Okay, so I know I did receive a box like this, and I got this really pretty, like, metallic eyeshadow in it. Um, it's like a gold color. Really, really pretty. Okay, if I can get it open... With nails, you can't open nothing. Okay. Glamour. I'm not really for sure if this is the one I got or not. I was thinking mine was more of a yellow tone. But it's really a pretty color that I got. This might actually be it. I'm not for sure. And these are like really soft. Especially made by... Ipsy for colored brain. Now that is a beautiful color. I could do so much with that color. So this might actually be the one I got. So I I like it. So now I've got a double. You could highlight with that if you go lightly. You can use that in the corner of your eyes for your brows. You can do it on your lids. So, like, really, you could do a lot. Even though it looks, like, darker in the pan, it's not really that dark. So, such a beautiful color. Okay, so this is by Context. It is a matte lipstick. And it is in the color 102 Sweet Emotions. Now, I did get a contact lipstick, but I do not believe this is it. So, here is the two. My other two looks pretty much like this. And this could be it. I'm not for sure. I thought mine was like, said something else. But that is it. And that is such a pretty color, um, which I had some lip gloss on earlier. It's pretty much gone, so. See, that is pretty. It's a good nude, neutral color, which we'll work with about any look for day or Days we don't want to do too much makeup or just need a good nude lip. Okay, so right now I'm like really happy with the four things I did get. Okay, so the last thing is Unicorn Glow. Uh, it's a hydrating primer. Its net weight is 0 0.35 ounces, which is 10 grams. Now, I've actually never had anything by them. These two products right here is two products I've not received from any from the brands themselves. I've never got anything from Dome, Dome Beauty. Let me get that out. And I never got anything from Unicorn Glow. Okay, the lipstick and the eyeshadows. Um, I probably have them. 
I didn't recognize the name, but it's probably the lipstick I do have. Okay, so this is a hydrating primer. I never heard anything about them, so I don't really know if they're going to be good or not. But hey, who doesn't need their skin hydrated? Today, my skin is thirsty. I've had makeup on probably ever since. It's like 5 o'clock right now. And I put my make started putting makeup on around 7, 7.30 this morning. So, my skin's very thirsty. So, it is just a clear, clearish white. And it's like, I don't know. It don't really feel like primer I've ever used before. I don't have no smell to it. Which, I don't like a smell and things going on my face. And if they, do, if they do have a smell, I want it to be something that goes away, like, really fast. But I'll be honest. I really don't feel it on my skin. I don't know if it's supposed to be like your skin is sucking it up. I don't think my hand sucked it up. So, I don't know. So, I'm not really for sure. It's like, I can't really tell. No, you can't really feel it. Okay, I don't know how I feel about that. Um, normally, a primer, I want to have, like, a certain feel to it. I want it to be a little tacky, a little, um, uh, that you don't even feel like it's went on, like it's going to do anything. So, I don't know. Maybe it's just, you know, it is a hydrating primer, so maybe it's just your skin sucks it up. I don't know. But I'm doubting it. Um... So, I really don't like the feel of that one. Um, I've got hydrating primers, and normally mine feels different than that. And I, I like that better. So, the feel of the other one's better. So, I don't know how I feel about that. I guess I could use it and try it out. And I'll, we will see. It could be the greatest thing since sliced bread. Who knows? But I don't know. I just don't like the feel of it. But I haven't tried it yet. So, I don't know if I'm going to like it yet or not. So... For the holiday mystery bag. How do I feel? I received five items. Which. Three of them being probably something I already have. I'm not really sure if the brown one was in it or not. Because I have used the palette a few times. But I haven't used it in a while. And I can't remember. And I don't. Not really know where it's at right now. But this brown is probably in it. If I can remember right, I think it is in there. So, like you can say, I've pretty much got these three items. I didn't have these two. I think with our holiday mystery bundles or bag, it would be like more of a mystery. If you put something in it that we haven't received or, you know, something in that sort. Because we get the bags every month. So... Um, and you pretty much know what, I don't know, it's just puts the other stuff in there that hasn't been shipped out in the bags would make more sense to me, but I guess that's their company, not mine, but to me, the bag is, I'm just going to give it like a two and a half out of five, the bag is really cute, so I'm going to give it a half a point there, and I did receive two items that I, uh, I've never received before, so I'll give them two points, and I'm really excited about the blush. The hydrating primer, I'm not really sure about. So, we'll see how it goes. Um, but, with me already receiving three of the products, to me, it's just a two and a half out of five. Um, but, I guess that's it. And, you know, someone else might get this bag and they may never received these before. But, I have and that's just the way I'm giving it. Which, they are really good size samples. Um, I mean, these are pretty good size pans. Uh, all of them was. I don't even. Oh, I laid them in some. Okay. Like you can see, these are really good size. So, you know. But, so since I already have them, they're not really. I will probably give them to my sister or something like that. Um, I wish I hadn't swatched them. I could have saved them for a giveaway. 
which I need to start doing besides opening them and just really need to look at my stuff first and then swatch what I already have and then put them back for giveaways. But I guess that is it. I hope you guys did like this video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. And I will leave the link down below for real Ipsy in case you would like to try Ipsy for yourself. And I guess that is it. And I will see you guys in the next one. Bye for now.